Hi, I'm Kara Sheftel with BDS and I want to tell you about one of the new things that is going to revolutionize and change the print world. And it's going to be mandatory, so let's dig in. So what is Windows Protected Print? Windows Protected Print is changing the permissions that are allowed when you're printing. Right now, some print drivers are based on language and coding that is over 20 years old. You can imagine the vulnerabilities that might happen with that. So permissions are changing specifically on how jobs are spooled to devices where that is the most vulnerable in terms of attack. You may remember a few years ago that there was a Windows vulnerability that uh, they even had to update Windows 7 because print was so vulnerable in terms of taking over your network. So once you enable WPP, and it is something that you can disable, you will no longer be able to use any of your old drivers because all of the permissions change and they will no longer have the access that they used to have. You have to have a Mopria uh, enabled device it's really important that it's Mopria enabled for print and Mopria enabled for scanning. If you have one or the other, you might not have full functionality of your Windows compatibility with your multifunction printer. This is a big change and a lot of your third party software, such as your accounting software, your manufacturing software, are still going to be looking for those print drivers. So you may not be able to enable Windows protected print. Copier companies are aware of this and they are going to start working on the codes that are necessary to ensure compatibility. Most multifunction printers as they stand are ready for Mopria, but you might lose capabilities such as finishing or if you have a specific workflow. So it's going to take time and I anticipate that this is going to take over a decade to implement. Right now at BDS, we are suggesting that you do not enable Windows Protected Print until all things are ready. If you have questions about your workflows and how it would work or not work with Windows Protected Print, we are suggesting that you reach out to your copier company or you can certainly like and follow this channel.